Right, so we're at the next day. Uh, I did actually have a lot of footage in between the last clip that you saw and this one. However, uh, my hard drive got full, so it didn't actually record, which is a nightmare. So let's give you an update on where we're at now on the second day of the server. Uh, well, still within the first 24 hours, to be fair. Um, we have this base turned into metal. We've also got these plants up. Plants are super, super strong on these servers because of the orb protection and the extra damage they do when you're offline. Uh, a few turrets, one on the two on the front, one on the back, which is not too bad for now. We've got this nice Ravager, quite high level. Unfortunately, the guys put movement speed in this thing. I was hoping they'd put weight in it, but case sera, sera, it is what it is. Um, what else have we got? We've got some Spinos in here. It's a couple of Spinos. I'm trying to make some C4 right now. I want to make like 10. There's a little um, base around the side. We've just started turning to metal. So I'm thinking that might be nice to uh, go say hello to him. See what's going on there. And other than that, we're all good really. Got these forges going. I actually am trying to make this grinder right now. I really want to make the industrial grinder. Um, just need more crystal. Uh, we've got the polymer and we're just waiting for the ingots to smell, but it's taking ages. Might have to make more forges, but to be honest, there's only so much around here. So, I don't know, it might take a little while, but that is my early morning mission. The guys that I play with are currently offline. They play a lot on um, American time zone. Let's grab that kyan out of there and turn that into paste. Can never have too much paste going on. It's four, isn't it? Yep, yeah, four and eight for the paste. And yeah, it's just all about grinding out. So let's get that C4. Let's go see if we can blow to that base next to us. And hopefully it'll have some nice little bits. Desperate for some blueprints. All right, here's our guy. Has he been raided already? Oh, he's been raided already. Damn, made this C4 for nothing. All right, let's see if there's someone else we can break into. I'm pretty sure I saw some guys up here and around the corner. Let's see what they're up to. Oh, well, these are the guys they've been blown into already. That's a yikes. Everyone around us is getting blown into. It's absolutely mad. All right, guys, so a lot has happened here. Um, unfortunately, I haven't been able to play the first two days. I played the first day, and the next two days I wasn't on. I had a friend come stay with me. I was also busy with some other commitments. So we had just our two tribe members here, Bundy and our man Dante, try to defend against what ended up being three different tribes trying to fob up on us here. Uh, they did manage to survive, but obviously it meant a real bad hit to our progression and a real bad hit to a couple of our teams that we had and all that kind of thing. So, although luckily we still have a base here and, you know, we should be okay for now, um, they really, really struggled. So the base is looking all right, but there's not much gear. There's not many tames. So I need to go and do some taming today. Luckily today, I'm no lifing it. You guys can join me for the ride. So I'm going to go get ourselves a, a light pair. Then we're going to go get maybe a Ravager. And then with the Ravager, I think I'm going to do some farming. So do have one crab, but I'm going to be on my own a lot today. So um, I don't want to be um, going around on my only crab when I'm on my own on a very high pop high grief server so let's head over to the um forest get ourselves a light pep and then we'll go from there so we've got some neighbors here very very close to us um the guys were saying they attacked us once then left us alone but oh here he is oh you think he's got the wrong place don't know where he's gone but yeah, I'm going to try and chat with them, see if we can stay like neutral with them, because uh, we are never going to survive if these guys um, mess with us. It's just going to be too rough, so Let's see if we make friends. Dun, dun, here I am, Dante. Do, 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 do. And here's Bundy. Damn, uh, please hi. eat me. All right. Here, you want to you wanna get on this. No, 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 don't do that. Oh, there you go. There you go. I'm a professional, uh, boys. Bundy, we gotta get the doorway so we can do that. 
do 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 pregnant just like that voice do 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 So luckily we managed to get pregnant there thanks to my buddy Dante's hard work. He was down there just all the time trying to look for good Reaper Kings and I just run up in there and get pregnant first time of trying. Anyway, once that's done, obviously get the levels, just kill a few Spinos. I think it's 10 times on MTS, so it's so quick to get all the levels and then we're ready to give birth. Oh God, the ominous sounds of a baby reaper king so uh, all three of us here are pregnant right now as you can see from my uh well large intestine belly here surely it should be a bit higher up but yeah about to give birth to a what will be a 220 uh, i think it was a 145 that makes sense yeah i think it was 145 and uh, all three of us have got pregnant by the same one so i'm hoping obviously for either a melee or a um health one any good stats would be you know decent as long as it's not food or oxygen can't remember if these things have oxygen anyway let's uh hatch this thing here we go <laughs> love getting reaper kings man they're so cool there we go claimed i just need to eat me let's have a little look at the stats if we can didn't screen that oh that looks like low health We'll see. I really wanted a health one. I love soaking. Come on, eat me again. Melee looks okay, especially if I get the imprint on it. Looks like it might be a melee reaper, in all honesty. Oh well. Right, we are desperate need for a doed. Found a 130 here. This would be absolutely perfect. There's some raptors around, which is kind of the way. But hopefully this will, will go fine. Oh, finally. Uh, it is annoyingly in one of these zones here. How are we doing for melee? It doesn't look too incredible. Oof, 17 points, but at least it's high level. We're all good. Okay, bit of a result. We managed to find a 150 Ravager. Actually spawned it just below base. The Doed is tamed. Dante is taking the stone up right now. Got so much stone. It's awesome. Um, but I'm going to be solo for a while now. The guys are going off on their US time zone. Uh, they're heading to bed. They've done really good today though. It's been absolutely awesome. So continuing a bit of a solo farm grind today. A bit of taming. A bit of everything for you guys to watch. Hopefully things go our way. So, still on solo right now. Grind's going pretty well. Came down here to give myself a little bit of oil. I'd converted all of our oil into um, into gasoline. So, I just had to come get some oil. So, I want to make a cooker, which is 300. And I've got 320. Got my Ravager as well here. Let's uh, give this a little name. Alright, there we go. Nice little bulb dog as well. Not the best looking, but does a job. Right, so back to the base now. Going to make the cooker. Um, Going to look at making possibly med brews now as well. And uh, just loads and loads of bullets. Now we've got all the tools. We've got the doed, the crab, the anki, even a higher weight ravager. All the tools to make farming very, very easy on here. So should be able to just smash it out now and make ourselves very difficult to raid. All right, continuing decent session indeed. The uh, Reaper Kings are done. Mine's actually away at the moment. It's quite good health. Got many rock drakes. Well, I say many. I think they've got five altogether, but they should raise nice and quick. These are my ones over here. Got the green one. And the purple one, which is here. 
Nice little lady. No incredible stats on either of them, but um, not bad all-rounders. You can see 29 stam, 30 melee, 5 health. So that's a definite all-rounder, not too bad. This one, fortunately, had quite a high oxygen stat, 30, and a high food, 34. But it's not terrible either way, and uh, rock drinks are obviously game changers allowing you to get around aberration so much quicker so looking good we've uh, expanded the base we've expanded it to a four by four don't really need much bigger than that i'm going to do a second level one here as well so just a four high well a four by four by four basically and i think that will do for this area and then obviously we're going to work on turret towers for the branches over there and over there um, but it's been good we've got all of us on today for the first time in a couple of days so progress has been pretty good. So that's going to round off this video, guys. Hope you're enjoying this little check at Aberration. I just think it's fun to have this cool change of scenery. I haven't played Ab in absolutely ages. Really enjoyed it once I started. Once those rock drakes are fully grown, we can start getting the high tier drops and all that kind of stuff. Got loads of Reapers on the way, so it's looking good for the next few episodes. Either way, don't forget to smash that like button if you haven't done so already, guys. And I'll see you next time.